this is Sandra McCracken, and we are here to count down to Christmas. We are looking at songs and scriptures as we prepare our hearts for what is next. Um, so today's reading is from Psalm 72, and the song, um, the theme is Ring the Bells, and um, it's both the song and the title today um, because it just seems fitting. So here we go. This is Psalm 72, verses 2 through 8 in the message. Let the mountains give exuberant witness, shape the hills with the contours of right living. Please stand up for the poor, help the children of the needy, come down hard on the cruel tyrants, outlast the sun, outlive the moon, age after age after age. Be rainfall on cut grass, earth refreshing rain showers. Let righteousness burst into blossom and peace abound into the moon fades into nothing. Rule from sea to sea, from the river to the rim. So in this reading, I um, I love this reading, and it reminds me in a loose um, parallel to the song Ring the Bells. Um, I think in many ways, as I spent time with it, I was thinking about how Christmas time is the best excuse to preach the good news in public. And there are ways that we have, um, we just have an opportunity to tell the story and to tell the story not only that um, that God is with us, but that he is with us in spite of the brokenness we see in the world. So Psalm 72 is a Christmas prayer. And then I start thinking about it and I think, well, all of the Psalms are really Christmas Psalms in a sense because we are in the anticipation of um, all things being restored. Um, when I was a kid, one of my favorite records was the Johnny Cash Christmas album. And he had a song, my favorite song, or the one, one of the most memorable was um, a song he had covered called I Heard the Bells on Christmas Day. And the lyrics for that, that when, when I sat down to write this song, Ring the Bells, that was on my mind. And wanting to write something that was contemporary, that was like living in the place that we're in, but that also would give voice to the hope that we have. And so... Um, I'm actually going to, sit, going to read a couple of his lyrics, which is, I heard the bells on Christmas Day, their old familiar carols play, and wild and sweet the words repeat of peace on earth, goodwill to men. And, and he goes through this psalm of his own and traces how, um, in despair I bowed my head, there is no peace on earth, I said, for hate is strong that mocks the song of peace on earth, good, goodwill to men. And in the same way that the Psalms have their, their space for lament before there is the joy of the morning. So we sing ourselves forward into the reality of Christmas. So we ring the bells to accompany the song, the lament and the petition that God is with us. And there's more than just sugar and gifts and all the things that we know to be Christmas, but there is actual real hope that we can, um, that we can sing about. So um, he is with us. It's good news.